Today is just a bland and boring rainy day. But something came in the mail today that's going to add some color and some light and going to make those boring rainy days a little more special. Let's find out what it is together. Hi YouTube, so today we're gonna to do a quick video on the MT Pro by Aperture. Aperture makes some of the best lights out there for anybody that wants to use any kind of lights for videography or photography. They are a little bit more expensive and more pricey, but as far as I, I've seen, they work the best, they last the longest, and they're top of the line. A lot of YouTubers that you see like doing YouTube videos and stuff will use Aperture lights. Um, they are awesome for doing wedding videography or photography. Um, if you don't want to use like a flash or something like that, you can use like a, a tube light or some kind of light just to add some extra light to your photos so you don't have to use flash. Um, there's many, many different reasons to use a, a light versus a flash um, to get different looks and whatnot for your videos or photos. Um, if you want to add some color, um, instead of using gels and stuff with a flash, a lot of times lights are great for being able to just change the color and just quickly just you see exactly what you're going to get in a, a light versus a flash. One of the really nice things about using lights in your photography versus a flash, for instance, is with lights, you're able to see exactly what your photo is going to look like if you have a mirrorless camera. You're gonna be able to look inside your viewfinder or on your screen on your mirrorless camera and see exactly what your photo is gonna look like, which is great. And that's why I love using lights for my photography. So lights like the MT Pro are great for like, if you wanna add accent color to your room. Um, so you'll see that my room's like blue and a little bit purple. Um, it's really kind of nice for if you're doing YouTube videos or anything like this and you wanna just add some color to your room um, to separate yourself from the background. Uh, so like the background's kind of like a bluish purple right now and I'm kind of just like, normal color with a little bit of an accent on the side of my face. Um, I do this with the uh, MT Pro. The MT Pro is actually over here right now. That's why I have like a purplish hue on the side of my face. Kind of just breaks it up a little bit. So it's just not like boring. But what you could do is actually uh, change this light to just be like another um, key light and it just kind of like light up that side of your face a little bit. You could also put it behind you. So like say I wanted to, so here's the MT Pro. I, if I wanted to put this like over here, yeah, I wanted to do that. So now it's just kind of like, you could just, just put it in the background. It's just like a, a light to add some character to your video. One of the features on the MT Pro is it has two magnets on it, which are really useful for sticking it on anything metal. So if you want to use it in the background for something in one of your videos and there's something metal, you could just stick it to the background somewhere on anything that's metal. So I really like that feature with the MT Pro. Another thing that's really nice about the MT Pro is it is charged via USB-C, which is a plus in my book. Um, and it comes with a um, cover basically that you could direct the light a little bit better. It's made out of like a, uh, I would say like a cloth type material with like cardboard in the inside. It feels really durable and strong. Um, I have no concern about it being not like not holding up over time. The MT Pro does come with two quarter 20s. You can use those two quarter 20s with the tripod that is included. You could put in uh, one of the two spots, which is really kind of nice that they include a tripod with it. It's, it's really helpful for like, if you want to just set it up somewhere real quick. So I, I am appreciative that they did send it with a uh, tripod and has two quarter 20s on it. So that's really useful. Another really nice thing about the MT Pro is it is compatible with the app. I do use the app a lot for weddings and stuff like that. So um, I do really like the app. It works really well. I don't have any problems with it. Um, it's really very um, stable. I, it's never really given me any problems. It's always just hooked right up to um, my aperture lights. So I do like the app and it being compatible with the app is definitely a big plus. Overall, I'm very happy with my purchase of my MT Pro and I look forward to buying other aperture products in the future. And um, I just wanted to share this video with you guys and just give you my thoughts and opinions on the uh, MT Pro. Um, if you like the MT Pro, let me know in the comments below. And if you didn't like the MT Pro, also let me in the comments below. I'd love to hear what you guys think. And if you did find this useful or helpful, this video, um, please think about subscribing. Uh, I'd love to hear from you in the future and future videos. And um, until next time, I will see you in the next video.